Hey guys, it's your girl Linda Mary. Welcome back to the last vlog of our moving out series. So this is a day to us moving out. I had thought of removing the carpet at night, but then just decided to do it the following day as we are leaving. It has just hit me that tonight is the last night that we'll be spending in our house, in this house. <laughs> We've been here for three years. Why are you making that expression? It's because I'm going to miss our house. We're going to miss our house. <laughs> and the shares. I don't like someone when she has our shares. That's make me angry. When someone has a what? Shelves. The shelves. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that makes me angry. You don't other people to have our shelves. No. <laughs> Let's sleep. Tomorrow is another day. Shut up. We are leaving. I've packed everything. At some point, I had to just stop filming the posing camera, changing uh, the camera. I couldn't do it because I'm packing alone. I had to uh, stop filming. So I could pack and I've finished everything. We want to leave uh, the guy with the pickup is coming on his way and he's coming with two other people to help me offload and okay to help me put them into the vehicle and then when they get there to offload so this is how everything is this is for the gas so i have plastics and some things in here i've packed everything shoes plates there that's my tripod curtains here the suitcase that the carpet i've rolled it there are these two small things this one doesn't have a box so i'm going to cover it with this and then this table, this duvet, I wanted to put it inside that thing, but it's not possible. It's too heavy, so it will just go like this. So basically, that's it. The house is now empty. When you come to the kitchen, yes, the people who are coming, I think the dance are going to help me remove this. I don't know how to remove them. So I'm not leaving with that. Everything is empty. Everything is empty here. Everything is empty. Even in the bedroom. Except the bed. <laughs> I'm not living with this plant. I know it looks good, but I'll explain later. This cement, is it, I don't know if it's too cement. Cement, it's too heavy to a point where I was feeling like it was cracking. It's too heavy. I'll prefer a lighter one or real plants. And I'm leaving this. The Raja has really complained that you're leaving our shelves, but <laughs> we have to leave. So the bed, they'll, they'll uh, fix it when they come. Everything. I'm not moving with this chair. I'm not leaving with that chair. So the pickup guy will be here any minute and then we'll start taking them down. I just want us to pray for this house. I've lived here for three years and I loved living here. But I had decided that when things get got better, I would clear my areas and then just move out. Because I wanted a new beginning. Because I love this house but it goes to a point where you just symbolized pain and suffering because the pain and suffering that I've gone through here I don't think I've gone through that in my entire adulthood so let's just pray for the people who will be getting into this house so that they can come in and just own a clean slate and write their own story and experience new moments and not have any kind of pain and suffering see you mama <laughs> you're seeing half of her face so <sighs> So close your eyes, let's pray, Mama. <sighs> Father, we thank you for the moments that we've had in this house. We thank you for the time that you've been with us. We thank you for all the beautiful memories that we have of this house. Father, as we are leaving, Father, we just cleanse this house. Let the people that will move into this house have a new beginning. Let them write their own stories. Let them have joy in this house. <sighs> Let them not experience the pain that we've experienced and be as Lord as you're also living on a new chapter for Jesus Christ name we pray. Amen. Amen. Mom why do you sound sad? Tell me. I'm just sad to leave our house. It's just a Even bit. me <laughs> I'm sad. Okay bye guys. So uh, bye bye guys. Uh, yeah see you in, we in the car. <laughs> But why are you showing the ball? <laughs> Everything in your mouth. <laughs> you are seeing the car when you are leaving. <laughs> ah! Let me enjoy this view one last time. Never looked in the mirror and not seen your 
yourself Like you got lost somewhere along the way Well maybe you just need some help getting back But that's not something they tell you these days I never wanted to be that girl But I'm stuck on this rural street Good job, good job. What are you, Mama? What are you doing? What are you doing? And I guess that's how they recognize me. I'm not actually here anymore. I've forgotten what I came here for You with the bright eyes I envy you Cold and bitter, that's what I've come to You with the bright eyes I envy you Cold and bitter, that's what I've come to There's no one around for miles They left Good morning guys, so we got here I think by the time they were done with putting everything inside the house it was around 7pm I'm really really tired but there are things that I have to do I want to organize what I can and then the rest will organize with him in the evening Things like the med I keep getting notifications but I can't turn off the wifi Things like the bed will organize with him when he comes back Oh he's going to work, <laughs> I forgot to tell you So you see how big his kitchen is from here That suitcase was outside actually I was filming yesterday because now I'm doing vlogmas. Since I'm posting every day, I have to film. The, this suitcase was outside. I'm going to show you outside the balcony. It's so big. But now it has some of our clothes. So I have to, I have to get it inside and get our, our pajamas and everything. But what I want to do, I want to clean that. That's, that should be in another video. Here, what I want to do is, you see, this is my cooker. And that's my mtungi. Uh, the cylinder so I just want to switch these two because you see this is where the socket is and now it has dragged up to here I just want to move these ones closer here because we use the fridge and the microwave but since we're not using this one we're using his cooker this one can be at the corner so that's it I also want to find a place for this maybe you can even give you that later let me show you this balcony eh hey, I love a big balcony I love balconies, so you see, some of our things are here. The carpet, the sky plast, this one has some clothes and some things. See, our buckets, those things are ours, my table. See, my brother had to remove his table now from the living room. We'll just figure things out. But basically, you see, that is where some of our things are. And... Also, I'm telling you it's a mess. That's why I'm saying I can't relax. I have to try to tidy up what I can. Some things are here in the corridor. This is the bed. Because you see my type of the type of bed that I have, it's not one like you can uh, disassemble and put the parts together. This part cannot be disassembled. So it has to be like this. So my brother will come and put this in his bedroom because his bed can be here. Yeah. Disassemble and then we disassemble his and put the parts somewhere. I'm not going to show you my brother's bedroom. I don't want to invade his, invade his privacy. Taraji, what are you doing? Making a slide. My goodness. 
this one is having the time of her life. We slept here because we hadn't figured out this bed situation. My brother wanted us to sleep on the bedroom, but no, I wanted him to have the bed because he, he was waking up early to prepare and then he'll need his clothes in the wardrobe, wardrobe and everything. So I didn't want him to have to come from the living room to come get his clothes and where will he dress up. I was like, let him sleep in the bedroom. So we decided to sleep here. It was very comfortable. And yes, our uh, bed is so everything is everywhere. So you see, I have to act this child of mine. <laughs> so I have to, you see, some things will organize with him, but let me organize what I can. <laughs> so, guys, now that you're all caught up with yeah what happened and where we are right now we're just going to continue with normal videos and keep updating you <laughs> so guys thank you so much for being with me on this journey and following what has been happening thank you so much for watching this vlog and see you in our next vlog bye bye, bye. I want to tell them something. Mm -hmm. First, like a big, big thumbs up. Subscribe to our channel. Click this bell button and you and you will be the first one to watch our videos. Hey, content creator there. Okay, thanks so much, girl. Follow <laughs> us on Instagram and Facebook. Guys, bye-bye. See you in the next vlog. Bye-bye.